This morning on Today's Consumer, the latest marketing trend to get you into the store has retailers smelling like a rose. That's right. Today, consumer correspondent Janice Lieberman is here to explain. Good morning, Janice. Good morning. That she has great. a... Oh, <laughs> she smells everything, this gal. <laughs> well, it's called scent marketing, and the next time you head to the mall, take a deep breath to smell just what we mean. Store owners hoping a sweet bouquet will make you want to linger so they can wake up and smell the profits. Certain products have always been best known by their scent. But what about shoes, motorcycles, and sunglasses? Solstice sunglass stores now pipe in the smell of coconut. Gives you the feeling as if you've arrived at the beach. Nine West is starting to romance their customers with the aroma of mandarin and rosebuds. It's a marketing technique called ambient scenting. When somebody comes in, and they're pleased with their surrounding, they identify with the brand, they linger longer, and when they linger longer, they buy. I followed my nose to this lab where Prolitech, one of the largest scent marketing companies, comes up with unique ways to brand a product. We recently worked on a project uh, for a well-known American motorcycle manufacturer. We came up with a few concepts. Sun and sky, open road, maybe with dirt. Dirt. Dirt, dirt. Dirt smells like something. Ooh, I smell. At casinos like the Bellagio and MGM Grand, you might detect notes of lavender and sage as you spin the roulette wheel. It smells like a Weston. Regulars at Weston hotels will find the same white tea scent, whether they're in New York or Japan. I thought the spa had opened up on the first floor. <laughs> it, it smelled that nice. To demonstrate how it works, Prolitech asked us for a list of words that best capture the Today Show. We chose fresh, bright, timely, and family. Scent designers said fresh might mean citrus notes, bright could be florals, and family a warm amber aroma. We as human beings can, are capable of smelling over 10,000 different scents. It's a trend that's growing, despite the economic downturn. In fact, at Goodwill, the idea is to keep the new customers the recession brought in. If I go to a store and it smells bad, I don't stay. You may have a preconceived notion of what a Goodwill store smells like, but the organization is out to change that. Everybody loves apple pie, mom's apple pie. So is this the trend of the moment, or will the smell linger? Retailers cashing in on the sweet smell of success. Retail analysts say it's a trend that's here to stay, partly because it works on both men and women, which is kind of interesting, although you say you have a much better smell than... Right, and it's, and, and it's a curse, because then you smell all the bad smells, too. True. Like so, 30 feet. Which <laughs> well, I'm now, I'm now smelling our, our Today Show scent. Well, you've got the yeah. machine here. If I'd not seen the machine... I wouldn't have maybe, maybe said anything, but it does feel... What? Well, I, I would have thought maybe it was the perfume when you were wearing, but it's, it smells very fresh. Fresh, yeah. fresh yeah. optimistic, but, bright new day. That's yeah, what we asked them go. for. Yeah. Citrus, can you name any of the other smells? I mean, I thought I smelled something grass, like grassy, like Hey, almost... hey, 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 not around here. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. You mean like law? Oh, I'm sorry, yes. Yeah, fresh cut grass. I, yes. Okay, I oh, they oh, They have water lilies, freesia, lily of the value valley and soft wood and amber tones okay. to make you start your day fresh and Aww. with, you know, happiness and brightness like you guys Thanks, portray Janice. every day. You, you bring that every time you just oh, walk in the well, I'm just going to leave this machine and so, have it follow me. <laughs> so folks at home just scratch their screen. They'll smell this, right? I'm well, kidding. Just, yes. I'm kidding, of okay. course. Anyway, Janice Lieberman, thanks very Thank much. Thank you. Great to have you here.